Bien, salut à tous, c'est Mister Sponge et aujourd'hui on se retrouve pour le 26 e épisode d'Anna's Quest, donc euh, sans doute la dernière session que je ferai euh, avant de finir le jeu. Et donc, rappelez-vous dans le dernier épisode, on a été plongé dans le passé de Winfried après un twist absolument époustouflant où la reine a parcouru plus de 3000 bornes à pied euh, à travers la montagne de glace pour, euh, pour tout simplement... Euh, rejoindre la cérémonie et interrompre Winfried qui allait se marier avec le roi. Jacob, c'est lui, mais il me dit absolument rien en fait. Je vois pas du tout qui c'est. Winnie, you finished detention. Are you okay? I hope mother wasn't too hard on you. I'm fine, Yannicka. It's just detention. Not that you'd know what that's like. I know you're a tough cookie, Winnie. I just think that, well, sometimes mother is a bit hard on you is all. She has to be. With the Wanderer coming and the grades she's getting. Ha, okay, je exactly. je pas. There's no way she'll ever beat you, Yannicka. It's not a competition, Wilhelm. There's only one way Winnie will ever get through the Wanderer's test. Diving into the lake and taking the Amber Orb from Vice Frauen. Don't even joke about that. You know what happened to poor Yorinda. Yeah, maybe Winnie could get some advice from her. If she ever talked again, that is. Yeah, well, maybe I will. Then I'd really show you guys. Winnie, no! La nana the derrière, c'est Yorinda. You don't know what they do. You can pass the test without a silly orb. I know you can. I said Frauen. Only you guys would still believe in silly children's tales like that. I have a secret advantage anyway that will make me ten times better than Yannicka. But, but it's really not a competition. <laughs> yeah, right. Here comes the science babble. It's not babble. You'll see. I'll prove you all wrong and win the test. Come on, everyone. It's Friday. Let's just have fun. Wait a second. Not everyone is here. Where's Hans? Want... Do you guys know where he went? Ah, he oui, said he was pensais. going to the usual place. He seemed pretty excited. Yeah, their usual little lovebird hideout. It's not like that. Ugh. Not everyone is like you boys, spending all day dribbling and drooling all over precious you-know-who. Who know who? No, no one, Yannicka. <laughs> I can okay. never remember his stupid code for the hideout though. I hope he's written it down somewhere. Ok, euh, alors lui je ne sais pas qui c'est. Yoringel. Il me disait absolument rien. Lui par contre Yoringel, ça je, je vois, il a exactement la même date. Mais lui, Yoringel par contre, bon il a, il a changé. Hein. How's it going Yoringel? Huh? You never talk to me. What do you want from me? Ton raisin. Tu t'éclates avec TB à ce que je vois. Enjoying those berries, I see. Very much so. And no, you can't have any. Ah. Fine. Foiré. I was just making a joke. Vas-y, partage. Peut-être yeah, plus right. là. You're just trying to trick me into giving you my lunch. You guys always teasing me, trying to take my stuff. But I. Ah. Oh. Excusez-moi, retour window. Qu'est-ce que tu fais tout seul ici Pourquoi tu vas pas aller à draguer l'autre la, la Yorinda là Ok then. Why are you always on your own? What do you care? You don't care about me. No one cares about me. T'as mec qui est remonté quand même. I'm asking you because because you're a trickster. You just want to trick me. I know what you guys are like. Acting like my friend just so you can take my stuff. But hey, I've never. No more. I won't fall. T'as quand même elle fait une tête mais complètement blasée mais H24 en fait. Either. From now on, Yoringo only cares about Yoringo. Okay, okay, jeez. Forget I asked. Okay, ouais, je vais, je vais le laisser tranquille parce qu'il a l'air un peu venir. You happy now? Very. Hmm. You're my berries. Mon berry. Yoringo, elle a l'air super gentille. Hey there, Yorinda. Still not saying much, huh? Between you and me, though. This thing with not talking, was it really from seeing the vice of Frauen? I mean, they aren't real, right? Oh, never mind. Ah, d'accord, en fait, elle parle vrai. En fait, je crois que c'était son fantôme qui parlait pas, euh, parce que je sais pas, le fantôme parle pas ou un truc comme ça. Mais non, en fait, c'est vraiment genre. Euh... Alors, c'est soit par choix, soit c'est parce que justement, elle a vu les, les vice of Frauen. Euh, ce qui l'a choqué un peu euh, comme les, les cheveux blancs en fait. Above the amber orb though, when you fell in the lake, you sure you didn't see the orb? Because I could be wrong, but I think even if you did see it, then you wouldn't tell me, because like everyone else, you think it's too dangerous. Yeah, I bet I'm right. It's there, I'm sure of it. 
Bah écoute-moi bien, Winfried, c'est un petit violon, on peut s'arranger. Je connais un petit chef, euh, un petit chef poulet très très ré réputé. Et... Il peut t'arranger le truc. You seem kind of lonely over here. I could be wrong, but you seem to keep glancing at someone in the yard. Aha, I'm not wrong. Ah ouais, c'est vrai, ça rega regardez. Alors, c'est complètement du fou, hein, je pense, mais, euh, mais j'ai l'impression que l'un regarde l'autre. Un chef poulet, oui, c'est euh, Beethoven von Rikiki ou un truc comme ça, le, le chef poulet qui est à Wunderhorn. À qui on a donc euh, échangé son violon euh, contre le violon magique à la boutique du mec. Ok, donc c'est là-dedans. Euh... Vers la cabane. There must be really cool stuff in there. These two brothers, all this one's playing the I'm too. He's been trying for years and she still doesn't get it. Hey Jacob. <sighs> What's the deal with the flower? Is this some kind of fashion thing or it it's nothing. Yeah, sure. Fashion. That's exactly what it is. Really? Because I don't know. It looks kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Like you'd know anything about fashion. If that's fashion, then I'm glad I don't. Po po po. Lui, je l'aime pas rien que comment il est. Wilhelm, I need to ask you something. Sup, Wynn? Can I have a go? Uh, no, I don't want girls in my yo-yo. Ouais, ça se voit Whatever. qu'ils ont 8 9 ans. Hein. I saw you let Yannicka use it before. Yeah, well, Yannicka is a girl. C'est une, uh, une demoiselle. Oh, Jeez, give me a break. Yes, I'm good. You... Ok, on va se barrer à la forêt. Bon, c'est qui qui vit dans l'arbre là Ah Ok, donc il y a un code en fait, d'accord, c'est le code pour entrer. Ok. Oh, Yorinda Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-Hans-
Le code est là. Le code est juste là. Alors, je vais juste me le noter. Oups là, le stylo. Alors attendez, donc c'est. Tac. 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 Et tac, ok. On est bon, on est chaud. Attends, je vais juste vérifier que j'ai bien de. Ouais, c'est bon. Ok, on est bon. C'est parti, on a le code. Mais ça, ça m'intrigue vraiment, ce, ce, cette photo. Ah, donc, alors, attendez, c'est donc. Tac. Allez, c'est le GG Ah, oh, putain, c'est quoi ce truc Hans Hello Winnie Oh <rire> Sorry, I didn't hear you come in, but I, I'm glad you're finally here. Yeah, well, if it wasn't for your dang door code, what's got you all excited, huh? You'll never believe what I found. C'est le truc qu'elle nous a mis sur la tête tout au début. I barely believe it myself. Last night, by the orphanage, I heard two travelers talking about something. They said it was the scientific discovery of the century. Well, what was it? Winnie, they found it. They found just what we've been looking for. It's called telekinesis. I'm not following. What's telekinesis? Telekinesis. Y yes. Well, I wasn't so sure. Je sais pas pourquoi, mais j'ai une idée qui vient de me traverser l'esprit. Imaginez le twist de fou si en fait Winfried c'était notre maman. Dun 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 dun. Was actually a witch then? No, no, Winnie. That's the thing. He was just a regular farmer. And that's not all. He, 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 he could, could read people's thoughts and feelings, their memories. The townsfolk accused him of being a witch. Ah oui, le petit dragon. J'avais pas vu. À droite, il y a le petit dragon. About witchcraft. He just sensed his abilities. Okay, that's nice for him. But I still don't see why you're all excited. Right. Yes. Well, I did some research after hearing this. And it's just like I thought. All the things that were said about this man's abilities. It's just like the third eye chakra spells. Third eye? Isn't that the subject we had a few weeks ago in class? Exactly. Don't you see? It's what we've been looking for. It's a connection between science and witchcraft, Winnie. You mean, this would show Mother once and for all that science is important? Exactly. Just think of the possibilities too, the discoveries we could make with this. Hold on. This is what the third eye thinks. Oula, il a ouvert les yeux en entier. Ça, 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 ça m'inspire rien. Pass it easily. Well, sure, but not just that. If we can learn more about what telekinesis is, then we can help people understand magic through science. People won't have to be afraid of us anymore. This is it. This could be what finally helps me beat Yannicka once and for all. Oh, but Winnie, I think p p p perhaps we should concentrate on... Right. What do we do now? Can we get it? This telekinesis? Telekinesis. Right, right, whatever. How do we get it? What do we do? Well, maybe, but perhaps we shouldn't rush into this. Rush? Hans, the Wanderer's test is any day now. Mother was just lecturing me about it. If I get this telenemimus, if I use it to pass this test, my weird will be perfect. Mother won't have to scold me or tell me off anymore. Right. That is true. And maybe finally, finally, Mother will stop comparing me. I'll never have to be told I'm not as good as precious little Yannicka ever again. Yeah. Yeah, you're right, Winnie. Let's do it. Let's help you pass that test. So, details, details. How are we going to do this? Oui, passer ce type à la quai. Tenez, 
j'arrive même pas à lire comment elle le prononce. Télé, Ténélecosi. Où est ce télécomisis gars gone? Let's go find him. Surely he could just tell me how to pass my test if he wants to help people, right? Actually, that was kind of my first thought too. That's why I'm fixing this machine. The idea is that it reads patterns of energy moving in the brain when you wear it. So if we observe this man's brain patterns, then perhaps we could even replicate them. Yes, that sounds great. Let's do it. Um, but I, I'm not so sure. It might take time. Oh, the this jeune, machine ça still needs a lot of work. And the man, he went into hiding. What? Why? To avoid punishment. These townspeople, they're really serious about putting an end to witchcraft. Ugh, darn people. Always getting so worked up about stuff they don't know anything about. Yes, well, well that's why they get worked up, Winnie. We just have to be patient. Find ways to help them understand, you know? Yeah, yeah, sure. Whatever you say. Euh, oui, passé. Non, ça j'ai déjà demandé. Te souviens-tu de quelque chose à propos du sort de troisième œil Je te parie qu'il faut avoir l'orbe. Je sais pas pourquoi, mais je te parie qu'il faut avoir l'orbe. Ah, yes, I looked over my notes last night. We were never taught any direct awakening spells, but there's one incantation Mrs. Vogt recited from her spell book that kind of fits. Okay, great. Ouais, donc il va falloir que je chope le truc du... It's an incantation to summon the goddess Minerva for extrasensory insight and knowledge. You imbue magic beads with the spell, then place them on your head to help open your third eye. But Winnie... You know that Mrs. Vogt's spell book is strictly off the spell book. You know, All right. So first we need a plan for swiping the spell book again. What else? Oh, well, from what I remember, the beads are okay. I have some left over from class. But we also need three candles. One of white, one of Du coup, j'ai pas du tout regardé ce qu'il me fallait. One of the blue. Hmm. That could be tricky. I don't think there's any left in the school. We... we could make them though. We can? All right, great. Swipe spell book. Make candles. Easy. Let's get cracking then. Ok, alors, facile sur le papier. Qu'est-ce qu'il nous faudrait What alors Je pense qu'il nous faut de... Uh, il faut du charbon. Well, tu, tu vois know it's possible. I just don't know how. Yannicka's the one who told ah, me about gagne. it. Maybe you can ask her. Oh. Right, of course she did. Ugh. But I do know how to make dyes. So if we can make candles, I can help color them. As long as it's the right color, it can be flowers, plants, stuff like that. I have a book on biology around here that might help you. Hmm. And we need white, purple, and blue. Keep your eyes open, and if you see anything, bring it to me and I'll take care of the dye. Okay. Mère m'a demandé de, de venir de way, te voir. Mother said you have to go see her about your test. Oh right. I still need to pass the smoke appearance module. Smoke appearance? Oh, is that for your elective? Yeah, methods of appearing. The only reason I chose it is because I thought I could fake it with solidified carbon dioxide. Turns out, not so easy to move around or use on my own. Solid carbon What? Solidify carbon dioxide. It's that smoky stuff behind me there. Ouais, c'est pas vraiment facile, ouais. Et c'est un phénomène qu'on peut recréer dans la vie réelle, hein. Donc euh, je vous incite à aller voir la neige liquide, c'est pas mal sympa. Enfin, c'est pas vraiment... Ça s'appelle pas neige liquide, mais c'est dans le ciel. Then that happens a lot faster and makes a lot more fog. Ah, I see. And then you'd use that to disguise your appearance. Clever, clever. Hmm. Maybe. Elle a, elle a, elle a pas été douée par la nature cette gamine. Regardez l'air méchant qu'elle a. Disappearance as well. Winnie, what are you planning now? Hans, we'll use this to steal the spell book. It's perfect. If there's as much fog as you say, it should be easy to grab it while Mother is distracted. Sure, but like I said, it's too cold to carry. 
and we don't have any gloves. And besides, I can't really drop it in water without Mrs. Volk noticing. Right, right. Don't worry about all that. I'll find a way I can help while you're doing the test. Leave it to me. I'll figure it out. Euh, on a tout ce qu'il faut. Je vais aller commencer okay, à chercher. Alors, donc là, est-ce qu'il y a des livres qui pourraient m'intéresser Hans' books are pretty complex. Usually I can find a good one, though. There's Euclidean works in space and number theory. Charles Babbage and the Turing equivalent. Yeah. Oh, this must be the biology book Hans mentioned. Biology for beginners. Um... Je me demande justement si le titre qu'elle vient d'énoncer, c'est pas le titre qu'on avait trouvé dans sa pièce au château aussi. Et si c'est pas les mêmes plans aussi. Euh, salut à, à nouveau, euh, Hey. You kidding me? That's like... Le certificat aussi, on l'avait. Nah, I think. Ouch! Yikes, that's flipping cold. Ouais, so this is that dry ice stuff Hans was talking about. I wonder if it will really make as much fog when added to water as he says it will. Il est trop mignon. Ah, he looks hungry. I better find something for him to eat first. He doesn't like being handled too much when he's hungry. Do you? No, you don't. Est-ce que est-ce que du charbon il en boufferait d'ailleurs. Tiens. Voilà. Oh, excuse you. Oh. All right. Time to get rid of that fiery breath before you get a belly ache. Winnie, don't take him away for too long. You know the red dragon gets agitated when the baby's away from her. I know, I know. Jeez, you sound like mother. Hey, sorry. Just careful with the little guy, okay? I'm not putting my hand any. Euh, que je peux cramer le, le la ruche. I'm not sure what <rire> Genre pour tous les cramer. Parce que là, là, je sais, I'm not sure what... ah, je sais plus quelle couleur il me fallait. Je crois jaune, vert et je sais plus quoi. Je peux pas inter. Ah si. Third eye spell making. Hans is working on it. It's part of the machine. I guess this part has something. Things would be easier if we could just find him and get him to share his ability with us. These are just different chemicals we keep around for various experiments. Je crois qu'on a un peu tout fouillé. It's part of the machine. Hans is working. It's the brain. Or things would be easier if we could. Ok, on va ressortir. On va aller voir déjà Janik. Ouais. Oh, I'm tempted to go see. We'll see how Hans' incantation. Ok, ça je pense qu'il faudra, faudra faire quelque chose pour choper de la couleur peut-être. Du coup, on va aller voir la future reine. Uh, hey, Yannicka. Hi, Winnie. What can I help you with? So, I heard you know how to make candles. Oh, yes. I wrote an essay for Mother on it last semester. Uh, of course you did. Do, do you think you could tell me how to make them, maybe? What was that, Winnie? Can you tell me how to make some dumb candles? Or not, whatever. I don't care. Oh, sure thing. I'd be happy to. Well, really, all you need is some wax, either paraffin ouais. or these ça, wax, ça, or something doutais. like that. Ah. Hold on. Aren't the crayons from school made from paraffin? I... I kind of fed them to the baby dragon. I don't know. He seemed ah. to like them. Aw, how cute. <laughs> well, if you do happen to find some wax... Then you just mold the wax around a wick and you're done. Wicks can be Violet, anything. Bleu et blanc pour a piece of string possible. or row or something like that. Then you can just dip them into various dyes to change the candle's color if you want to. Uh-huh. Wax, wick, dyes. Easy. Thanks. Thanks for nothing. Anytime, Winnie. I'm glad I could help. The optimist jusqu'à uh, jusqu'au bout. Oh. Je vais voir s'il n'y a pas des trucs du coup que je peux encore récupérer. Non. Euh... Alors, du violet, du bleu et du blanc. La, le blanc, ça sera avec la craie, je pense. Le violet, euh, ça sera avec le, le raisin. Est-ce que je peux les 40 Come on. You have like 
A million. So? They're my million grapes. Go get your own. Who's How's that? it going, your huh? Hold on, I do need those berries. Han said berries can be used for dye. It could be purple dye. Ha! I knew it! I told you you were just tricking me! Putain, no, mal no you don't understand. See, me and Hans... On you can't des... have any! Not one! Uh, but Yoringo, you've got plenty left. Oh, so you're gonna call me greedy now, is that it? No. Exactement just... ça. Don't you think you've kind of had your fill already? Oh, so now you're going to say I'm fat? Ah, no! Ah! Jeez, I can't win with you. Yoringo, you dummy. Of course someone cares about you. If you weren't so busy scowling at everyone, you might actually notice her glancing at you. What do you mean? Who? No one's glancing at me. Well, when did they glance at me? Uh, like, all the time. Oh, elle est trop mignonne, regardez-la. I... I don't believe you. You're just trying to trick me. Ugh. <sighs> Jeez, you boys are hopeless. Pfft. I don't care. There's only one person I want to look at me anyway. Oh? Uh, I, I mean... Ah, uh, dang it! You better not tease me about it, Winnie. Why don't you go tell this person then? It's not easy, you know. I... I don't know good words to say is all. You don't know... good words. I never know what to say to her. I get all... twisted with my tongue. You better not tell anyone, Winnie. All right, all right, I won't. Ok, euh, et bien du coup on va se laisser là pour cette, euh, pour ce 26 e déjà épisode d'Anna's Quest, j'espère dans tous les cas qu'il vous aura plu, on approche de la fin de l'histoire, là c'est le flashback, donc j'espère que ça vous aura plu, merci à toutes les personnes qui m'ont suivi sur le live notamment, n'hésitez pas comme d'habitude à laisser un like, un commentaire, à partager la vidéo autour de vous, et à vous abonner si ce n'est pas déjà fait, et surtout moi je vous dis à la prochaine pour un nouvel épisode, d'ici là portez-vous bien.